The excitement is building both here and in London for the Ravens' first ever game overseas. The team arrived earlier today and had their first practice across the Atlantic. WJC is in London. Sports director Mark Rubiano has more on how the Ravens are adjusting to this unique road trip. WJZ is out on the town in London. We're outside Buckingham Palace, but rest assured, the Ravens are resting tonight. They've done some traveling, and for an athlete, it can be overwhelming to travel overseas, dealing with time zone changes and fatigue. Well, the Ravens did arrive in London today, and they begin the process of tackling what can be a tough transition. Afternoon sun over Ravens practice in suburban London. But the players' body clocks are on Baltimore time, still early for these guys. But after a seven hour flight with little or no sleep, the Ravens don't hit the snooze alarm. They answer the bell with a sharp practice. I honestly thought we'd be zombies walking around out here. And, uh, you know, like I said, I, I feel like personally, it, it, since I've been on my feet, I've been pretty good. Let the world know. Let the world know. The game against Jacksonville Sunday is the Ravens' first time playing outside the United States. It means added attention from the media and fans. Thousands have flown from Baltimore to cheer the Ravens in London. We came into the airport and uh, there were Ravens fans everywhere. We had Ravens fans from from the states. We had Ravens fans from. Uh, from Great Britain, I think. You know, I heard a couple accents. Ravens lineman Jermaine Illuminor is familiar with those accents. He grew up in London, where he first saw American football and went on to play in the United States and now returns six years later, an English native in the annual London showcase. I, am. I feel like it's my job to inspire others to go after their goals and dreams. And, you know, if I didn't. If I, if I could achieve this, you know, and I'm here right now speaking in front of y'all about to play Wembley Stadium, why can't no one else do that, you know? We'll see if Jermaine Illuminor gets to play for the Ravens on Sunday. We do know that Brandon Williams will not. The Ravens' standout defensive tackle didn't even make the trip. He's been dealing with a foot injury, and that could be a factor when the Ravens face the Jaguars on Sunday. Back to you. And remember, Sunday, Mark will be there in London as the Ravens take on the Jacksonville Jaguars. You can see the game right here on WJZ. Our special coverage kicks off at 8 a.m.